you have been judged guilty of turning your heels on the face of the old gods. Your sorcery ends here, ends tonight. When you were a child, you sat, as all children sit, at the right hand of mercy. As a man, that hand wears an iron glove. You wear the hard winds of many battles on your brow. Time we have here is a luxury, General. To waste it for the sword makes you a slave. I am a slave to no man. No, you're a slave to many. All who've gone before you stumbled in their stupor for blood and riches, fame and accolades. Thirst makes you hollow. This is no common pillage. No campaign of dominion. The supplicants at the foot of this tower have been released from your malignancy. Paradise will find them pure of heart. <laughs> your footsteps of the righteous man are nothing of the kind. The salvation you see for those you put in chains, it is hollow. My calling is higher than your conjurings, wizard. Whatever the gods hold for me, I glimpse through our conquests, the spreading of our way. If the rivers must run red to see it through, then so be it. This is the law. The thrust of avarice is a blade stained with the cruelest of intentions. Laws are written by men. Conquest is written in chaos. But salvation, General, true rescue from one's deeds and the chains that bind him to them. That is the voice of the ephemeral wisdom. And that is the voice you do not hear. I hear only the law. You have a choice. The ages have suffered at the wheel of that storm. If you choose poorly, it is you who will suffer the ages. Only you can decide how long that is. You cannot expect me to believe my life is a falsehood. Your servitude shall be sustained until the work is done. You will walk the path of the eons. Your laws be damned and hear the voices of those under the heel.